So yeah, Soul Calibur 6 might be a thing. And a lot of people have been reporting on this. Me myself, I've been kind of delaying on reporting on this because I kind of want to get most of the information out to you guys at a pretty brief moment. And I really, really want the game to be true. Like, come on, man. Like, bro, Soul Calibur is one of the goldest fighting games ever. Creation, all that. But there's a lot of rumors from guest characters to even a lot of new mechanics being put into the game. And that's pretty damn cool in my opinion. Now I'm not gonna say these rumors are confirmed. Dude, Soul Calibur 6 has a 50-50 chance. Soul Calibur has much of a chance of being announced at the Tokyo, not Tokyo Game Show, at the Game Award with me hitting puberty. And I'm 17, so <laughs> yeah, so let's get into this. So, Soul Calibur 6 tidbits from the 8-way run forums. So a new Soul Calibur game actually about to be revealed. So Calibur fans have been waiting with bated breath to find out if the recent rumors circulating about the yet unconfirmed Soul Calibur 6 are leading to an actual game or not. That's for the game from Reddit. I don't know how to read that nigga name, okay? I'm sorry. I know I just the it. I'm not censoring that. From Reddit, at least one of the sources latest rumors or leaks if you're a believer is currently contributing to discussion on the subject of angry tour possibly posting a simple verb of it i don't know that guy generally has a weird ass name but pretty much he goes over some stuff that he's read and i'm gonna go over some but i'm also gonna give my own opinion overall when it comes to so Calibur, let's hope this rumor is true by god because we haven't seen a new so caliber game since so caliber 5 but i think that was really 2014, 2013, around then, it was an okay game, but the new characters were eh, and I really hope, because a lot of things that I've been hearing is that classic characters will be coming back, when I'm generally happy, because we get some news that Keelik will be coming back, and some news that Maxi, and the thing is that, you know, I generally like, the, I like the older characters, I love Siegfried, I love Keelik, one of my favorite characters is Maxi, just for how his personality and how energetic he is, well, let's get into this, so... <clears throat> Believe what you want, but Soul Calibur 6 is real, and you will see that it is soon enough. Even the information about it that I have been advised that under no circumstances leak, it c would dwindle down who is releasing the information to the like few if I did. So, he's basically saying, you know, take it with a grain of salt or not, but he thinks it's real. Generally, if you gotta do say that, uh, you, your sources are a little fishy, bro. But what I can say is that I am allowed to, to that I haven't yet is that there will be a huge focus on story elements in the game will still in motion capture phase even back in May of this year. My one problem with this so Calibur 6, I mean, so Calibur hasn't really had such a great story. How do I put it? Not mind blowing. But it's okay. I mean, it's the tales of dudes and swords, and yeah, I know that's Max. Thing, but it's the dude, it's the tale of souls and swords. But Soul Calibur 6 was the main story that we actually got when we had a full fleshed out story mode. We didn't even get like cutscenes. We got moving images that spoke to us and narrated to us, and we only got cutscenes in certain parts, like when Patroclus and was fighting Pyrrha and all that shit pretty much that so i really do hope that it's not you know story focused the game is very far behind schedule ever since the delay last year due to their moveset style switch up mechanic not working out like they wanted it to but like like i said recently they did retain this idea in a certain capacity ever you understand what i mean by this eventually so i guess he's kind of rumoring like a mortal kombat variation switch thing so something tells me you might can switch weapon or maybe you can actually choose character that does not have their weapon other way i mean either way jesus fucking crap i can't talk today i really can't but i just really want to get the video up and i ain't censoring shit so yeah YouTube take that for demonetization. I wish I could say more, but for now, everything I have said about it is what I am allowed to. I keep being told it is revealed very soon and in December, so regardless of it, they'll do it at TGA or PSX. It's happening next month. It, I was told it more than likely will not be displayed play in playable for a little while longer yet, though. Now, I'm going to dispel one rumor. It will not be shown at PSX. Let me explain why. 
PlayStation has already announced that Bandai Namco will not be appearing at PSX, will not be appearing at the PlayStation Experience. They don't expect any Dragon Ball Fighters, don't expect any Tekken, and don't expect anything of the Soul Calibur variety. Don't even expect like a Tales game or any of those games, because Namco Bandai will not be attending. So, that's pretty much the debunk. Now the Gaming Award, this would be amazing, like legit, this would get your rating the game. Without a lot of people wanting to like pretty much admit it, without Soul Calibur, the game would not be like, it's the first 3D game to have weapons and to have implement these side steps and all these things. And also the first game pretty much, you know, has these amazing ass graphics and all that, and it never really had a bad one in the um, series. It's, like, it's had mediocre or just good games, but it hasn't had terrible games. Like, Soul Calibur, let's, like, look through it. Soul Edge was good. Soul Calibur was good. Um, Soul Blade, but I think it's just Soul Edge, so don't take me back. Soul Calibur 2 was amazing, like, one of the best in the series. Soul Calibur 3 was also great. Soul Calibur 4, it was good, it was good. I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty pretty damn amazing. I just like it from the doubter, and I'm sorry, there's a motor strike off but <clears throat> I like it for the doubter reasons. Um, Soul Calibur 5, uh, 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 let's skip that. <laughs> and Soul Calibur Legends, which was for the Wii, despite it not it taking the Soul Calibur name, it was not a really a Soul Calibur game, it was more of a spin-off, but it was still okay. But, um, guest characters have already been pretty much thing, so let's finish reading. Claim to have knowledge of seven confirmable playable characters, Keelik, two other returning fighters, and foreign room fighter discussion of a possible guest character that will include Fire Emblem characters. So we can get like Mars, Link, Krom, Lucina, because there's a Nintendo Switch version, Link, and that, but surely that would be sort of exclusive and true, meaning the repeat of platform exclusive guest characters like some previous title. This new title is expected for PlayStation 4, PC, Nintendo Switch, but Xbox One isn't completely ruled out of here. So, I guess if we do get guest characters, like I want to see like a Bloodborne character. Um, I think Max already said that. I want to see it. Da I want to see Dante. Hell, even if we got like Metal Gear, right? But like, here's the thing: Nocturne did not need to be in Tekken. He should have been in. Um, he should have been in Soul Calibur. But if we already get a Final Fantasy character. Cross promotion with Final Fantasy um seven remake. Like get Cloud in there or hmm, not even just Final Fantasy character. There are tons of medieval characters. Maybe a Dark Soul Knight for like um something that's not con console exclusive. Maybe um who else? There's a lot of characters that could be in there. Tells characters. We can get Luke, we can get um the new girl from, from the Tales games. Um who else? We can get a lot of guest characters, in my opinion. Like, even with Ezio, Ezio was such a cool character to me. Um, hell, having the Star Wars characters in there were really lit. So, yeah. For one confirmed character, I can tell because they keep advertising her. It's probably Ivy, because you can't have a Soul Calibur game without Ivy. And the thing is, the reason why there's so much rumors and there's so much faith in this game is the 20th anniversary video that was shown earlier this year gave us sort of Hope Riser another game. Um, a reboot or basically um, a re-release of some of the games for the PS4 and Xbox One, maybe even certain, just a lot of hope for the game. So yeah, these are pretty much my like pretty much my thoughts and all that. But yeah, if you guys like this video, please give a nigga a like. It really helps the channel and it makes YouTube look the other way. Please comment down below. Who would you want to see as a guest character for Soul Calibur? Um, you guys already know who I want. I love you on the Xenoblade character in um, the Switch version, but hey. Um, but yeah, comment, like, and subscribe. Subscribe for more fighting game news. I got another video coming up for Devil May Cry and for My Hero Academia. Um, you're fighting in that been released. So I'll be talking to you guys next time. Play my outro, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.